This video is a demo of the game Arctic Awakening. Uh, first thing I'll mention is the uh, settings. Very limited. You can't even do uh, audio settings. So my apologies if, if it ends up being too loud. There's nothing I can do about it. I may try and adjust the stream volume if need be. Um, the full, it, it's not full screen exclusive, so this resolution I can change that and it doesn't actually change the resolution of the of my monitor, it doesn't, so it doesn't change the resolution of the game uh, in that way. So my capturing, I'm not, um, like I'm, I'm playing it at 1440p but I'm streaming it at 1080p because um, the the bandwidth of, of video stream like with Twitch or YouTube uh, will seriously be hampered uh, by streaming at 1440 so that's why we're going to stream at 1080 and hopefully you get a better picture for it um, less artifacts blockiness, stuff like that motion uh, compression artifacts so um, yeah let's get into it see what this game is about uh, one thing that they did mention uh, when I loaded this up was that the game doesn't have a save feature at the moment so yeah I'll I'll play it for a little while I don't know how long I can play it for though because it's already kind of just past midnight, so we might play it for an hour, or who knows, maybe I might still be here for two hours, depends how much fun we're having. So yeah, there's a... Um, Another game that I'm going to be thinking about when I'm playing this, which was called The Long Dark. Because they sound very similar. Pilot can't handle for now, but look, if we hit those white caps at landing, I'd be glad I told you to skip lunch before we left. Always thinking ahead, huh? Whole world's melting, so what do you do? Buy a water plane. Focus toward your children instead. 
Hey, don't bring them into this. Not while I'm on the job. Damn, starving back here, staring at all these rations. Speaking of, been to that new bar on 5th by Merrill? They got some mean reindeer sausage over there. Yeah, not really the bar type. Ah, oh, come on, let's hit it when we get back. You know, break the new place in with some war stories. What do you say? Yeah, we'll see. Uh, uh, let's just get this done, huh? That's the spirit. I'll tell them to keep some deer warm. Yeah, that doesn't mean I'm going. Just make sure those supplies are ready. Man, you love it. Trust me. Do you some good to hook up with some other vets. You should consider it. A bit of mingling might be good for you. With you in tow, at a vet bar? They'd laugh me out of the place. Perhaps I could get you special dispensation from the court. I might even be allowed to watch over your children. Donovan? Donovan! Donovan, you copy? Donovan, are you there? Ah, uh, where's that damn drone? Whew. Hey, drone, wake up. Purposed scrap, good for nothing. Oh, hello, sir. I must have unexpectedly powered off. Yeah, so did I. Can you locate Donovan's tracker for me? Wow, he was right in the back. Oh my goodness, have we crashed? Is everyone all right? Now you're catching on. Where's Donovan? One moment while I scan for networks. Strange. I detect no signal on the usual channels. None. Anywhere, in fact. Then start scouting the area for it. Unfortunately, under no circumstance am I allowed to just wander off without you. I need to stay within the proximity dictated by the court order. 
And what about Donovan? From what I know, he can handle himself. Besides, you cannot help anyone if you freeze first. So other than searching for Donovan, how can I be of assistance? I do want to help in any way I can, Kai. Just gather a few branches with me to start a fire. Very well. I can do that. I left that fire starter in a plane. But I agree thing. firewood out there. Yeah. Nothing in here. Build fire. Place firewood. Ah, this wood 
it's no good. All of this snow has made the kindling wet, but I have found some dead branches for you. There's a whole forest out there. I cannot explore the whole forest, but I will do my best. They must have equipped you with some sort of heat. I don't know, a, a laser, maybe? You seem to be confusing me with some sort of mechanic, which I can assure you I am not. I am unfortunately not designed for this type of situation. No thermal vision, no lasers, no useful functions whatsoever. Can you do anything to actually help? I am happy to talk it through with you. It is important to stay calm in situations like these. So, that's a no. Great. Uh, can you just pile some more branches in here at least? Come on, I know there's something in here that'll burn. Uh, perhaps the, um, let's see. Where's, how do I bring up my inventory? Not this. There's got to be something else in here. Aloha, Hawaii. Well, we don't need that one. What if? Ah, uh, what? Yep, see, hey. Kai, you really must focus on starting that fire. Maybe some component of the plane itself could act as a better kindling. And they said I was crazy to skip the flame resistant seats. Nothing. Just uh, keep collecting wood. Hello? Kai? You out there? Oh, thank God. I thought I'd lost you. Something sliced the tail clean off. What? You thought I was joking about that? Wait. You didn't bail? You... You actually landed her. In one piece. Sort of. But I haven't inspected the systems yet. That drone is worthless for anything but dragging branches. Uh, should be down in a cold one and full as a tick on a fat deer about now. But no. Great Kai calls about a quick buck. Now I'm freezing to death in no man's yeah, land. Yeah, you're the one who asked me for help, buddy. Remember? I was just being friendly. Can handle myself. All right, all right. Look, we just need to focus on getting out of here, okay? What's your location? Hell if I know. You dumped me in the damn forest. Well, technically, you jumped. What's going on? You hurt? No, I'm fine. Leg might be broke, but I've had worse. Let me just... 
Nope. Still can't walk on it. Look, uh, we're gonna be alright. We just need to hang on a bit longer. <laughs> Didn't take you for an optimist. Remember, first rule of survival. Get your head right. And try to stay positive. Huh. I must have missed that day in Pensacola. I wonder where they moved ground school to anyway. Whole place being underwater and all. Look, you need to keep warm, all right? Wrap up in your chute, dig into that snow. I got it covered, boy scout. Landed by some big-ass silos. A power station, maybe? Still freeze my ass off, but at least this blocks some Wait, wind. Wait, power station? Out here? <laughs> Out where? Don't even know where the hell we are. I mean, snow like this? In April? Siberia, for all we know. Someone will be looking for us, all right? Just hang on. <laughs> You're right. You seen it out there. We were the rescue. Anyway, uh, I don't know. guess I'll pull up then. Was that Donovan I heard on the radio? I sincerely hope he is all right. Yeah, he's alive and pissed. I knew we would find him. Things really are looking up. Looking up? We're in the middle of nowhere. My plane's wrecked, Donovan is freezing to death God knows where, and we've let those survivors down. I just thought of something. That, uh, body of yours still intact? Excuse me, but I do have a name. And I am not his. I am. But don't get any grand delusions, all right? You're no different than this plane or this watch. You're just a tool that can speak. Ask me your both tools. But, my point being, can't you use that thing to find me? Signal locator, or, or just have it start a search pattern? No, no, it's not getting a signal from you, or anywhere else either. No need to worry. It is only a matter of time before I get a signal and we can track him down. Storm blocking it? Yeah, maybe. Or maybe its brain is fried, just like the plane. It went offline just as the trouble started. Just try to rest. We need to save our batteries. I'll call it first light, okay? Eye on the prize. Eye on the prize. All right. Over and out. Should I keep gathering wood? Uh, well, just shut down. No point wasting power in this weather. Kai, before I power down, this was not your fault. You know that, right? You will get through this. We all will. See, what was that? Was that a foot stick or a... Hey, wake up. What is the... Shh. Listen. Need to scare it off.
anything out here. Hmm. I suppose you will not be needing my help, since, as you put it, I am useless out here. If only you had that damn heat vision module. I have a lantern of sorts. Kai, over here. Wait, wait, what are we looking for? Hey, bear, get out of here. We got no food. But where's the bear? I can't see a bear. I don't know. There's definitely something out here. I believe it went this way. But perhaps it is not wise to. It'll just come back. Don't lose it. Follow the wrestling sounds. I mean, they're not. Where are they coming from? See, there's no. There's no direction. Something you should see. Uh, what? I flew above the fog and could see some sort of structure. Donovan mentioned power silos last night. Remember? All right. Uh, just give me a minute. Hey, Donovan. You up? Donovan, do you copy? Out there, something there. It's kind of weird that you can't access your inventory. Ah, yellow corner. Okay. Nothing on comms yet. He's probably still out cold. I... I mean, asleep. So where's this structure of yours? There is no clear walking path, but this clearing takes us in the general direction.
We can head left into the valley or follow the cliff's edge to the right. What do you think, Kai? Uh, and here I thought you'd be useful for a change. Probably the valley? This is the general direction, but I will follow your lead from here. Uh, I mean, if we go to the cliff, then we could possibly see further, but I mean, we're not going to be able to climb down, are we? <laughs> Funny looking plant, Just like a cardboard cutout. Yeah, I think maybe we might be able to see a longer distance if we look down from the cliff. Oh. oh, Donovan seems to be handling his predicament well. All things considered, I mean. You sure it's this way? Well, since I cannot pick up any networks, no, I am not sure. But unless you have any better ideas, yes, I do believe this to be the way. You might not admit it, but I can sense a bond between you two. Huh. They gave you the bond sensing upgrade, but no thermal vision. Probably another faulty sensor anyway. Well, yeah, I wouldn't prefer to go this way, but... I thought we could look out, you see, but I mean, you can't really look. This trees and um, with your beauty sleep? <laughs> you know I don't need any help in that department. Oh, well, there's no level of help can fix what you got. Ah, uh, freaking ah. Uh. So what's your status? I'm walking. Somewhere. Not sure if I should be following this drone, but it supposedly saw something. Maybe your power plant. Good morning, Donovan. How did you sleep? Uh, about as well as a mouse stuck on a glue trap. Legs pretty swollen too. See anything new in the light? A few more trees. Nothing else really. The place is bigger than I thought, I suppose. More silos too. Just hold tight. We don't need both of us getting lost out here. Don't have to worry about that. This leg's not carrying shit. <laughs> some sort of lift. Anything interesting at the top? We just found something. I'm sure. It's 
some sort of lift up the side of a cliff. The hell is this place? I don't know. Maybe one of those new inland plants is redundancy for coastal flooding. I don't suppose you've seen any workers? Oh yeah, yeah, I forgot to mention all the folks wandering around over here. Of course I ain't seen nobody dipshit. Don't you think I would have said? There is a path that forks through the forest, but I am not sure where it leads. Oh, I see something else below. One moment. Yeah. I think you should look at this. Kai, over here. What's going on? What do you see? <sighs> Don't keep me in suspense, man. What the heck? <laughs> I don't suppose your power plant has a giant satellite dish on it? Giant what now? I think I just found what needs that power. Oh, this is quite the discovery. Hang tight. Gotta be some help down there. Where's the um, silos, though? What do you think silos were? Hmm. Now we're going to get down there. you mean I could go for anything right about now wreck the plane got stranded in the bush likely gonna die that's all it took to get you to the bar you gonna soft on me hey, if it's on you I'll be there hell you check me out the plane and now I gotta pay oh shit man you should be buying for a year You'd zero my bank account inside a month you greedy bastard anyway let's save these batteries for a bit while I look around more I'll call back when I've got an update. Two old friends must have a story, right? Hey, you're right. Your files really don't give the full picture. Why? Did something happen? Well, I suppose he would say we were rivals of sorts. And were you? He probably still sees it that way. Some guys just handle the pressures of service differently. Anyway, that's ancient history now. You know, people tend to change with time, sometimes even grow. You should give him a chance. Good friends are harder to come by as you get older. Yeah, maybe you're right. He does seem to have mellowed out a bit. Is that why his call sign was Fireball? <laughs> no. Let's just say his first training flight ended in a bang. He's never really fond of that name, but it always made me smile. It would not hurt to reconnect with some old friends, even if they were not all that friendly before. Hiding out at your airstrip is no way to live. I'm not hiding. I'm... I'm serving the community. I just think it would do you some good to see people from time to time. I see plenty of people. You know what I mean. Friends, not customers. Yeah, well, let's just figure out this situation before dreaming up others. Wow. 
here. And look at the gates, do they? Crystal feet. From here, maybe? Be continued. What is that? It? Well, it was quite interesting. Um, I, th I think it's, you know, very similar kind of to um, the long dark. Um, you know, I thought that was alright as well, you know. This looks like it's alright. Um, yeah. It does feel a little bit like a walking simulator though. <laughs> but yeah, it's got story there, though, and that, that's quite interesting. It's got character to it. Um, the level of interaction is a bit limited, though. Like, you can't access your inventory. You can only jump and bolt and climb uh, when the game allows you to. Um, Yeah, there's not really much else to say, really. Uh, it, it sounds interesting. Uh, yeah, the game's got a lot of character to it. Uh, but, yeah, we didn't actually get to do much. It's a shame it ended so quickly. It would have been really nice to um, go for another, say, half an hour or 45 minutes or something, you know, just to get more of a feel of, of what the game is like, because, yeah, there wasn't really much here. I mean, we did play through a story in a way, it was... It was quite good in that regard, but um, yeah, it would have been nice if, if maybe we had to solve some puzzles or, um, you know, there's a bit more interaction, but, um, you know, on, on the player's part anyway, it, it was just like, just following the story, joining the dots, there wasn't, you know, there wasn't any um, real thought process needed. Um, you did make some choices of uh, responses and things, but um, yeah. At the end of the day, you probably would have just progressed through the story, no matter what you responded uh, or what you did. But anyway, um, yeah, that's Arctic Awakening. It looks interesting uh, if you like this kind of game. Uh, possibly it's uh, similar in a similar vein to um, The Long Dark so um, if you want to try the demo out yourself you can go to the Steam Store page and um, yeah I think uh, the Steam Store page mentioned that the game was coming out uh, sometime this year 
so uh, yeah thanks for watching and we'll catch you guys in the next one